<laughs> oh yeah, I was gonna it, ask. It's a like, what kind of bread do y'all use? Um, so it's, it's just flour and water. Really? Organic like, whole wheat oh, flour. Oh wow! So like a tortilla chip almost, except yeah, not almost. fried. Wow. Exactly. So you like um, bake that in your oven? That's yeah, pretty yeah, cool. Yeah. 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 On the on the what do you call it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like yeah. a yeah. Yeah. What is it? Yeah. Comal? Yeah. No, uh, oh, no, that's not it. <laughs> I'm no, the wine have to be pure. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Hey Manny. Oh, oh there's yes. our emblems. We had a little table. Oh wow. Yeah. Uh, that's a so nice setup. You see the sister up in the corner? Uh, yes. She has a, a nephew that's a good friend of ours. He's a circuit overseer in Mozambique right now. Oh, wow. Man, so y'all y'all kind of do those sort of like missionary type things, except it's like, you know, it's not like probably the Mormons. Mormons, you said uh, they have like specific time frames that they have to complete or whatever. Yeah, he's he's been in that work. He, he actually, because we have what's called international construction workers. So they would go to other countries and help. Like in Mozambique, they didn't have a lot of skilled craftsmen for, for construction. So he would go over and help with projects and help train. He's been in several countries. So I think he'd been in that work about 20 years. And then they, uh, they switched him into the, uh, the ministry type work a few years ago when they finished some of the expansion in the building. And so now he's working in, uh, up in the northern part of Mozambique as a circuit overseer. Oh, wow. Oh, and if you hear any noises, that's uh, that's my grandma's cat in the background. Oh. <laughs> he's just uh, he's just rooting around, not minding his own business. All right, mm -hmm. there, calm down. <laughs> well, you know, Manny, the the, um, the the love that you talked about it's something that we obviously have to work at. Um, you know, just like your your own family. Oh yeah. Um, you know, relationships and things like that. Uh, especially the closer you get, uh, the more you need to work on them. Oh, because yeah. you know. Uh, like the saying, familiarity breeds contempt. Uh, oh, yes. You get to see everything <laughs> about a person the more you get to know them. And so mm -hmm. um, we work at that. In fact, the Watchtower we have for the following week, because uh, we study the watch, uh, our Watchtower publication, uh, we have a uh, question and answer discussion on Sundays usually. This Sunday we're not going to have it, but next week oh, okay. it's about showing tender affection for each other. And it actually talks about when we have disputes or when we're offended, how we should respond according to Bible principles and, um, you know, how important it is that we show that kind of love to each other, that it's not good enough to just tolerate right. one another. Yeah, I, mean, I really feel like each. that's that should be true of like humanity in general, but also on a family level as well as your mm -hmm. community, you know. Yeah. Um, I mean, as a father myself, like that, that really speaks to me. That's very important to me. I um, take a lot of pride and... Uh, find it very, very important uh, to be the head of my household and to make sure that everybody, you know, does have that sort of understanding with each other and that we do work through things that are, that need to be worked through. Mm -hmm. We don't just let things sit, you know. Well, the Bible agrees with that. <laughs> <laughs> well, Absolutely. that's that's good to hear because that's yeah. how I like to run my household. Yep. But, uh, I mean, like, I would love to find out more about all this. I mean, that's why I'm going to be meeting up with tomorrow so cool. <laughs> that's cool. i look forward to it very much that's good